And if you could just hold up the medal so everybody can see it. Yeah, for sure. There you go. That has to be an amazing feat for you. Um, tell me how it feels to have accomplished that. I mean, it was pretty amazing the feeling because uh, it's, a, it's a team event, it's a team effort, so I think it's a team win. Uh, I think we success and we fail as a team, and I think last night we had a pretty big success uh, as a team. I think everyone showed up uh, with their strength, and I was, I was pretty amazed to see how it all ended up against uh, Venezuela, who, had, who uh, had a pretty strong ride through. Absolutely. Um, you struggled in the, uh, the first round, though. Can you tell me about uh, how that worked out and what it was like? What yeah. it felt like afterwards. I think we had a pretty good qualifying, uh, posting a time of like 407, mm. 6 I think was our best time at sea level. So I think that was a pretty solid ride. Uh, and I think for sure we had some mess up uh, in the first round uh, later at night. Uh, but if would have been of that, I think the ride would have been even better than the one that morning. So for sure it was a. Uh, it was disappointing because I think we could have been could have beat Argentina that night, but I mean we still uh, managed to get ourselves to the bronze medal round for the next day, and I think I mean just for that it was still a pretty good night, mm -hmm. and I think also what was nice is that everyone went to bed at night and forget about that ride, and then the next morning uh, every, everybody was ready to race again. So you had a very hard time. Uh, a lot of energy went into your Omnium race as well. Do you think that affected uh, your performance in the Team Pursuit? I think for sure I was not 100% uh, the first day of the Team Pursuit because usually uh, it's like a World Cup or a major event, usually start with the Team Pursuit and then I go into my Omnium. So the, the, this way works pretty good because uh, Team Pursuit is very hard effort but it's, it's shorter so I think the recovery is a bit better. So racing the Omnium first for sure uh, I, was, I was pretty tired on, on Saturday. The first day of team pursuiting, uh, but I think it was just more mental because uh, I think I was still able, still able to do my work and I've done it and I think it didn't show. But for me, it was just a mental game because I was struggling way more than I, I used to. Uh, like from the start, like I was hurting all the way to the end. So for, I think it was just more mental because uh, I think I delivered, but it's just, it just was way harder in my head. And then after that, though, on Sunday, I had time to recover because one day of team pursuiting, I could recover, and then the next day for Sunday, the final, I think I was back to 110%, and I think everybody had recovered a little better, so I think everybody was better uh, last night, and it was always there. And, and in your Omnium, you yeah. had a really amazing flying lap, and your uh, Kegel was really something, yeah. too. Um, you struggled with the elimination race. You came out of that really early, surely earlier than you planned on. Yeah, I mean, it was kind of an up and down Omnium. Uh, in the three individual events, I posted three PBs for me at sea level. My pursuit was my best sea level, my kilo, my flying lap, everything was pretty good. So my fitness, my speed, everything was pretty nailed on. But for sure, the scratch race was fine. I mean, getting four there, it was okay. But in the elimination race, I for sure that like, getting eliminated nine on 11, that was not <laughs> my plan. I mean, I started pretty good and then it was a crash got neutralized and then I, I, I was not in a good space and I mean it was for sure a bad race so I went to bed that night like losing a couple of spots but I think the next morning started with the heel strong and the flying mm -hmm. lap and I went into that points race uh, like you know I wanted to fight for gold and not only protected bronze so maybe it's the reason why I, I lost my medal because I wanted maybe more than bronze but I think I'm not ashamed of that and even if the world champ was there I mean he's just another bike rider so I think I just wanted to go into that race and I don't know just fight for for gold I mean we were home and so my plan was not to defend bronze so maybe that's the reason why I lost it but at the end of the day I, I, I just gave everything I had and it was fifth that day so I ended up fifth but I think so getting that bronze medal with team pursuit after was kind of a just a nice just a nice finish so. absolutely good and what's next on your agenda? Uh, back home, training hard, and we'll be back in action for a Pan American uh, Championship that time in Chile right. in September. So Excellent. Thank you.